close by and mountains inside On the east side On to the past Marvel sea yeah. On the east side Things in the park Saved after dark Living on the east side Fair with the pride To be from the east I'm side On the east side With the sea close by and mountains inside On the east side the past majesty yeah. of each side Things in the park say that the dark Living on the east side Fair to be from the east side Inspired Yeah, comfortable That's good Unique Dangerous Terrible Blown down I guess <laughs> Devastating Safe It's sort of boring I guess Bullying. I just don't like it at all. It just makes me feel gross because, like, you know, so many people just out of nowhere just commit suicide, and most of it, you know, most of the time it's people from the east side. It's just birds because of like growing up with most of the people that have committed suicide. Oh, uh, the road's pretty bad, the buildings are as well. Well, earthquakes absolutely destroyed around here. City council not paying any attention to us. So many codes. Roadworks everywhere. Roadworks. We need to really sort those out. <laughs> the lack of facilities. So like when we had QE2, that was real good, but now we don't really have QE2, we don't have any of the cool places. So I have to go to the really other side of town or up to Ferry Mead to go to cool places. Probably the stigma, eh? Knowing that like everyone thinks that your area is like the lowest of the low and all that kind of stuff. Might they think like I had rough areas I suppose and rough people and like crimes and stuff is the first thing that would pop up. Looking at the two primary um, high schools in the east of Adenoi and Lord. Both schools have such strong negative connotations associated with them and that is kind of used as an umbrella stereotype for the east in general and specifically the youth. As I say, I've been the head boy at Linwood, I know that Linwood isn't as bad as the school's rep uh, makes it seem, but uh, it's just hard to get rid of. The fact that there's nothing to do and just like everyone gets himself in trouble. Like I've been through that stage because there's nothing to do. So I just do things that I think is cool but it's actually not. More um, free activities for kids, like young kids because not everyone in certain areas of these can afford activities like going to Clip and Climb. I would like to see more community-based activities or events, uh, like the Limwood Life Festival. There was a website that came up a while ago saying like, you can submit ideas for to what and go into red zone areas, so probably seeing some of them come real would be good. People in houses, like homeless people in houses. All these fast food shops and spend that money on practical things for teenagers to do, like another Kiwi too, or like more like ice skating rings, like something that people find fun. I'd like to see more of less cons. Just more progress, because it feels like you know it's been five years now, and they're still like they're just repeating stuff you know doing. And my dad, my dad's had his road done like ten times, so I don't know sort of finish what you start, I guess. Um, I'd like to see more of um, people caring about others or, you know, just like giving affection to that person instead of being mean to them or like calling them an outcast or something like that. Better house. Better roads. <laughs> <laughs> um, laughter. Because every time I see people around us, I mean the East, everyone's laughing. So it just makes me want to laugh too. It's very close knit. I mean, my family knows everyone, everyone knows my family. I walk down the street, say hello to everyone, that thing, you know, go to the shop, know the dairy owners. Probably like um, people around us are quite friendly despite like what people think, like that everyone's bad or whatever. Big open fields, just to be able to do stuff, especially like outdoor stuff, running around, biking, drone racing. It's a lot of open spaces which makes it great for like getting out but kind of boring because there's empty spaces. Really pretty, I guess. <laughs> I like the beaches. <laughs> the beaches are good. Having friends and family so close. Not really. 
adults listen to adults, not children. No. Not as much as other people's voices. Definitely not. As a youth, I don't feel it's heard by the council, or even by anyone of a higher power. Because they would just listen to people who are over the age of 18, you know, or even 20 for that, for that matter. The youth is really important to, for, to hear the youth, youth voice, especially in Christchurch, since we're going to be the ones with the leftover. To be honest, I feel like they're in it for the money, they don't really care, you know. I think that they don't care because, like, they're living a happy life and they're happy with it, but they don't think about the people that are not happy and just don't do anything about it. Yes and no. Um, I find that they'll only listen to certain things or certain people. Um, like, if you really want your voice heard, you've sort of got to do a, like, a survey, I guess you could say, and then, you know, get it signed, everything like that, by everyone around you, and have it put forward to, like, your local MP or to the council. From my experience, no. Well, not as obviously, maybe, as I think they should, but I would have to say no, though. If I did have an opinion, I think it would be hard for it to find somebody to talk to about it. Um, probably not. Probably not. No. No. I'd never liked the area. Right? I've been living there since I was, you know, since I was born, but like about 17 years of living there, I don't want to live there anymore, to be honest. I don't actually think it's safe. Like, so many people are doing bad things. I just don't feel safe, like, walking around the streets. Yeah. 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 Yes, I would. I would. Yes. Yes. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, of course. Uh, yeah, I would. Oh, yeah, of course. Yes. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll definitely stay here. Yeah. yeah, that's my home, it's where my family are. Yeah, definitely. Like, it's home, you know. Oh, wait, yeah, I love it. Out by the beach. Good place. Even though it can be bad sometimes, but it's, there's like good people there as well. So I can get to know better. Just like I said, it's a big family, I wouldn't want to move. I would like to like, help change it in a way, yeah, to change it. And this is who we are. Our voices are loud and we are proud. Yeah. 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 Yeah.